It's coming. Oh, it's coming. Marvel Comics. Acclaim Entertainment. And Software Creations. Oh yeah, y'all know what's coming. The Mysterious Life Foundation captured the lethal protector called Venom and removed five symbiotes spawned from him. But before these new symbiotes could destroy their parent, Venom escaped. Now he is forced to seek out his old foe, Spider-Man, and forge an uneasy alliance with the wall crawler to stop these symbiotes and cure his... Separation Anxiety. Hello everyone, welcome to Couch Quest and... Spider-Man and Venom teaming up again in Separation Anxiety. I had so much fun last time with Carnage, I figured, let's keep the ball rolling. Why not? It didn't take very long to get through it. And full disclosure, yes, the Infinite Lives Code is on because I am not a masochist. There is a password system in this game, which is thankfully a quality of life update over the last game. I'm still just going to plow right through this on Infinite Lives just to get through it. Sadly, there are no comic book cutscenes, just text crawls, so I will do my best to embellish those and make them entertaining for you. But without further ado, let's just jump right in as Venom. Recovering from his wounds, Venom realizes he must destroy his new children, or if the symbiote should bond with the wrong person, as in the case of the crazed criminal Cletus Cassidy, Cletus Cassidy's transformation into Carnage, the danger would be incalculable. Only with the aid of the amazing Spider-Man does Venom stand a chance of defeating this incredible menace. Except I'll be playing as, you know, Venom by himself. Because I don't have a friend. No, let's see. Get ready! We are Venom, and we are ready! Now there was a secret here. I always, yeah, maybe I can only reach it with Spidey. Oh well. Now you see this is very similar to Maximum Carnage so far, very similar sprite style, and even a lot of the enemies have been recycled. That's because Software Creations worked on this. However, no individual enemy names this time, just portraits with life bars on them. So, while I'm wailing on these dudes who we saw in the last game, how's everyone doing? You doing all right? Getting sleep? Drinking water? Make sure you're eating right. Hope you are. Otherwise, Venom will eat your brain. No, Venom, we will not eat their brains. We will eat their brains! Maybe that'll be my shtick for this game, is me arguing with Venom. Eddie Brock style. We will crawl on this wall! Venom, Venom. There we go! We figured it out! Ooh, trash can! Ah! Yes, I will be doing my Venom voice throughout. So why did I pick Venom over Spider-Man? Well, I had to make a choice in this one. It's not like the last one where I can swap between the two as gameplay goes, which is unfortunate. Though I suppose for the second game I could put in a password and just play as Spidey. But uh, I opted for Venom. I was leaning towards Spider-Man because like, yeah, Spider-Man's the more popular character. But then my wife actually pointed out to me, she said, isn't there a new Venom movie coming out? And he's like, you're right, but it's not like in October. I figured, you know what? Close enough. Yeah, at the, you know, and if you're watching this in the future, after the third Venom movie has come out, this is all pointless to you. I'm just informing my decision-making process for choosing Venom over Spidey. Come on. Well, okay, so in the Carnage video game, we had the explanation of New York was going crazy from, you know, outside influence. Why are all these random fools stepping up to Venom? He's Venom. Did the Life Foundation just put out a bounty and every thug in town decided, hey, I want a piece of that? So like before, oh, hey, yeah, lots of the, yeah, the same enemies from uh, Maximum Carnage. Boom, super hit. Same moves even. I bet you I can still do the same desperation move. Yep, spinny fists, spinny fists. Do the spinny fists. It's a little harder to do in this game. Boom! Boom, 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 boom! 
The fist of justice is gender neutral. Venom has no gender. Well, Eddie Brock does. But Venom the symbiote has no gender. Did I just launch that dude through the air? That was awesome. Venom will make you fly. Oh, watch this. There's a new way to throw people as soon as I can get it managed here. Come here. Yeah, look at this. <laughs> Yeet. Ah! <laughs> Boom! Oh, I needed to be. Oh well. Wish I had a rewind button. Oh well. Boop, boop, boop. I kick you in the head! <laughs> You're enjoying this just a little too much, Venom. Venom is feeling frustrated! Venom is single father with rebellious children. I think those are continues? Oh no, they're lives. Yeah, I have the infinite lives code on, so it's not showing up. That's okay. It just means we can plow right through this game without having to worry about messing about from continue menus and all that. I love that ground pound. That ground pound is also another reason I like playing as Venom. Yep. Infinite lives! Arr, I will eat your brains! No, Venom. You're the good guys. Why cannot good guys eat brains? These are just street thugs. This is fun. Whee! Come on, Venom, do the thing. Do the thing, Venom. Come on. Ow. There we go. He did the thing. Come on. Ah! Got you! What is that noise? This boss music. This is no, uh, you know, mob rules. We're just gonna hang up out here because, oh, it's some sort of digger. There we go. Ow. Yeah, this is a step up from the enemies. Yeah, the Life Foundation, which I believe are the main antagonists in the first Venom movie, have uh, some Marvel New York super science on their side. So that means armored suits and whatnot. Oh, we got him. <laughs> Stage complete. <laughs> Just look at him. Look at how happy he is. <laughs> Venom likes to hit people a lot. After tangling with the digger, Venom's head is heads upstate to New York. His goal stop the Evil Life Foundation and their soldiers who are at this very moment trying to bond the in, the symbiote spawn. I do not remember the different spawns' names, except for Scream. I think she had her own, like, spin-off comic at one point. Oh, rooftop. What? A Spider-Man? Nope, not a rooftop. Bridge. What do we got? Life Foundation soldiers who have the goofiest-looking uniforms. Doctor Doom is mocking your, per your uniforms, men. But then again, it's no worse than the... You know, classic Hydra uniform, I suppose, but. Can I eat their brains? We'll discuss it later. But they are the bad guys! They are the ones who literally took pieces of Venom! And made more Venoms! Like I said, we'll discuss it. Fine! Too many words! Not enough punching! Come on, there we go. Spinny fists. Which is not nearly as useful as it used to be. It's also a little harder to pull off in this game. Button timing is weird. Oh yeah, that's right. These guys have grenades. Lame. Yeah, not as fun when the enemies have guns and munitions. That 
charge attack does decent damage. Ooh, well, not decent, but it allows me to knock him down at least. See, there'll be a point where I have to web swing, right? Yep, there we go. Ow. There's his symbiote shield there. And more grenades. Spinny spin. Spin to win. When the Ninja Turtles have better desperation attacks than you, Venom, there's a problem. <laughs> All right. Swingy swing. I'm glad this is much better than the second level in Maximum Carnage, let me tell you, which is still my least favorite level. It'd be one thing if you died over and over again. It's impeding your progress over and over again. I don't like that. That, that That's some, uh... That's some Ninja Gaiden Castlevania nonsense right there. Woohoo! <laughs> Come on! Venom will make you fly! He shot me! He shot me! <laughs> oh, what do we got? More Life Foundation soldiers. I feel like you guys are going to be the, the foot clan of this game. Speaking of Ninja Turtles, here's a trick I learned from the Ninja Turtles. Jump kick over and over. Ow. Look at these weird cartoonishly, cartoonish martial arts these guys be doing. I really hate the grenades. Come on. He shoot me. He shot me. He punched me. I will eat your brain. Oh, more of them. How come throwing them at somebody never works? I'll just, I'll pick up and punch fools all day. What do we got now? Ooh, extra life. Not that I need it. Who are we facing? Oh, much better boss music. Who's this dude? I mean, he looks slightly more like a soldier than the other guys do. At least he has some better armor. Is that, that's your whole bit? You have a gun? I also say the music, I mean, it's still enjoyable, but it seems like it took a hit from last time. No green jelly this time. I mean, they obviously tried to replicate the sound a bit, but. Stage complete. What you do not know is that Venom eats their brains off camera. Venom, Venom don't say stuff like that. Venom will say what he wants. You will not censor him. After fighting off the first wave of Life Foundation soldiers and making it across the bridge, Venom heads to the woods to try and locate the entrance. Make a pretty good time through this game. 15 minutes in on level 3. Also, with Infinite Lives, I don't feel the necessity to constantly use save states. Oh no. Oh no. I hope this isn't a maze level. That would s that would suck. Ah! Spinny fists! Power hit! I can power hit all the time. Probably the cheat code for that, but I think Infinite Lives is sufficient. I want to recreate the experience of the game as much as possible. You guys can just keep a death counter to yourselves and just tell me how many times I've died. Boom! There we go. <laughs> so here, you, you can eat their hearts, not their brains. You can eat all the little hearts. These are not real hearts. They taste like candy and disappointment. Ooh. 
Those are not chocolate hearts? If it were chocolate hearts, we'd be much less disappointed. Yeah, power hit. All right, through the cave you go. Oh boy, yep, this is definitely gonna be a maze level. So this might be the rest of the episode, is me figuring out how to work this maze. Wrong button. That leads down. Smart guy, avoiding my grasp like that. Yeah. Mmm, I will eat his heart. Even though it is not his real heart. It is chalky and disappointing. <laughs> I do not like the the loud bombs. The loud balls. They hurt venom. Oh, we got another digger. It digs! It digs! Congratulations, you have the same power as a Pokemon. Ooh, up or down? <laughs> Why does this amuse me so much? A heart! We want it! Again, that never works. Yeah, so once again, imagine how this would be if I didn't have infinite lives. Um, let's try it up. Said so this might take me a while. Starving. We will take anything at this point. Sorry if I mess up the pronouns on Venom. I'm trying to be accurate, but, you know, I'm not used to referring to myself in the plural. Venom's pronouns are we and us. All right. Here we go. And we get... Yeah, we can just run right past those fools. Awesome. Oh, he got a gun. He got a gun. He got to go. What are those breakdance moves? What is this? Oh, there's another. Oh, here we go. Hup. <laughs> Venom loves the thrill of a good fight. <laughs> Ha, spinny fists. Yum. You're starting to get an acquired taste for that, aren't you? A little bit. What do we got? What do we got? What are you? You look like me. I'm you, but daddy. We will see about that. Yeah, it's basically just the same model as Venom. But different color and no spider symbol. Oh, that little dodgy move you do is going to get so annoying. Apparently I have to counter your jump with another jump. Oh, oh, he's getting more aggressive with it. If I have to dash you to death, I will. Seriously, the jump kick, dive kick! That's your one move, huh? 
Come on. Yeah, this is one move. Dive, kick, and roll. You fight like me! You are me! It's almost down. Almost got him. Come here! Ah! Whoa! Trap room. You look like Hot Topic Iron Man. I don't know what you are. You will release us! No guns! No bombs! You kick me in the shin! Why did you kick me in the shin? I'm oh, sorry. Why did you kick us in the shin? Robots! And they kept the same sound effect, I love it! Blah, 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 blah. <laughs> I love it. <laughs> oh, that's right, the trap rooms give you your passwords. Yeah, that's probably a good point to do a save. Do, 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 same config position zero! There we go. Do, 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 do. Especially when we got, like, what, ten minutes left? The Life Foundation never thought that Venom would make it this far, but Venom managed to find his way to the entrance to the underground, the Foundation's underground complex. Venom realizes that once he enters the Foundation, there can be no turning back. Debating whether or not I should try to finish this in two episodes or not. Yep, here's the elevator. I'll do the elevator level and then call it an episode, and however long it takes to finish the game, I'll do it. Just like I did last time, you know? Because these aren't terribly long games, they're just difficult. That's how they banked on you getting a lot of your replay value, is just get good. Urgh. I do not like the explody balls! Oh, sorry. We do not like the explody balls! Penny fists. Heart. I had a power hit and I lost it. Oh well. Oh wait, there it is. This punch. 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 Do it. Do it. Do it. Dang it. This is starting to get annoying. Did Eddie Brock just watch like a lot of wrestling and that's why his special move is a sp spinning clothesline? I keep getting the power hits and I never get a chance to really use them. Boom! There we go. Who are we fighting now? Who are we fighting now? Oh, whoever this dude is. What the? Who is this? What is this? Just as a random invulnerability shield. I'm just gonna sit here and keep smacking you every time. Oh. Seriously, are you a guy in a mocap suit? I mean, we've got the good boss music again. And once again, of course, I'm playing this on the Super NES because the sound is better. Who was that for? Stage complete. Maybe one more level. One more level. I think one more level. After encountering a member of the jury, one of the Life Foundation's elite guards, Venom enters a virtual underground city. So fast it seems impossible that it exists. There's no time to waste as he prepares to get through the city as quickly as possible to reach his final goal. Okay, maybe we will call it here because this sounds very near end of gamey to me. Wait, is that what I think it is? It is! Oh, this has made me so happy! Alright, well we will call it here for now, guys. So, 
Thank you so much for joining me on this first episode of uh, Spider-Man and Venom in Separation Anxiety. I hope you're having a good time. And hey, I hope you're having a great day. I'll catch you next time. Hey everyone, thank you so much for watching the video. If you enjoyed it, be sure to like, comment, subscribe, and share it with your friends. It really helps me out. Also, be sure to click that bell and check out our social media pages for regular updates. Hope you're having a great day.